raised town on public land or where we started in the last episode. Different spot, but same area. While walking in this morning, I heard some deer. I heard some deer go crashing through here. I don't know if they've already made it past where I'm at. I kind of circled around them. I'm set up here, and my dad's going to just push these woods out towards me. It's, uh, it's 7.10 right now. So it's going to take a while for it to get light. Hopefully we get some shooting in today. Just heard three shots. And then I heard another closer shot down here. You can use a rifle uh, if you're a senior or a junior hunter. They're for sure going to get these deer moving today. It's amazing how good their eyes are. I am 200 yards away and they spotted me. So, here's what we're looking at now. I don't like hunting a field. I don't always think a deer's gonna travel via field when they're, especially when they're getting shot at. But they can't, they will sometimes. But I always think they would prefer a thicket and stay in the thicket. going on 9 o'clock and uh, obviously <coughs> haven't seen anything other than those deer that I bumped walking in. I'm gonna probably start walking around soon and just see if I can stir something up I guess. Almost just got shot so Someone with a 22 is up there shooting squirrels. And one ricocheted and went right by me. So I'm hiding behind this tree. Wow. This guy's getting closer and closer to shoot. He hasn't hit me yet. But he just shot again. I don't know what to do. <clears throat> Try and move. Try to get out of here without getting hit. Freaking ridiculous. that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go move again. Try to get away from this idiot. There's, there's squirrels all over the place. And if he doesn't know I'm here, he's going to freaking shoot me. Alright, let's get out of here. <laughs> 